So we're just chilling on a volcano. We just defeated some evil people, and it's time to see what is going on inside this here temple place. Seems like an odd place to put a temple. This baby erupts and it's gone, but there's usually just like one item in here. It is a fire gem, which we have come to expect. We got all the gems from these things. Um, and that's really all that we can do here. But I assume we'll be able to go through this door at some point, but unfortunately we cannot do that now. So it is time to pretty much get off of Mount High Point here and we can go back and take on the gym leader. There's freaking Fiance here too. Fiance, yeah, I guess that's pretty fitting. Haven't seen any of those things in the wild. Just a little electric, happy looking dudes. But okay. Uh, so we can't freaking fly off this mountain. Of course, we have to run our asses all the way down because they want to see me struggle. At least we can run from these Fiance with Dracula though. So. Um, also, I'm not sure if we're good enough levels for the gym. I'm assuming we probably are. Um, but uh, might be a little bit scary. We don't really have the best for uh, her type but I think we're just gonna we're just gonna go for it and kind of see how it happens my god there's so many wild Pokemon please get out of my face you happy ass little blitzy you know what do I have any do I have repels it would be nice if I had repels what are we working with here super repels thank god okay we're we gonna use that there is an item that I missed down that way maybe I can, can snag that if I go back the way I came I don't know how the hell I missed it but where I think I just go this way Wait, hello? There it is. Better be a damn useful item. It's Ooh, it's TM35 for flamethrower. So that's actually pretty damn good that I didn't miss up on that. So, nice. All right. Um, we are pretty much out of here. Super Repel got us all the way through. And we're pretty much back in the city. So, pretty interesting little volcano excursion we had there. Made it out in one piece. But it was hot as titty. So, we're good. All right. Um, repel wears off. Don't want to use another. Now, let's go back and heal. And then, oh, uh oh, something's happening at the gym. It's this freaking guy. Hayden, I heard about Mount, Hi Mount High Point. Who are those guys? They'd better not get in my way. Already beaten Amber and got the badge. That's five badges down and three to go. Easy. Better catch up. Gonna wait Tide City now. Here, there's a fishing contest there. I might go and see what I can catch. Catch you later, loser. So that's where we're gonna head next. Uh, this guy's always a step ahead of us, man. What a dickhead. I thought that was at the gym, but it was, in fact, just, uh... Is that guy just hanging out? So, we'll get a nice little heal here. Uh, we had a little bit of a scary double battle against the um, the evil team people there, but we're good to go. And who should I leave in front? So, Charlotte's not going to be all that useful. Marvin might be pretty good. I think we'll probably just leave Dracula in front for now. We're not going to be using Ghost because only level 35 and a freaking Ice type, so not too ideal. But I think we'll probably be okay. Happy will be pretty good. Uh, we do at least have a water move, and we're neutral against fire, so. Alright, here we have the old gym. What does the sign say? We got Amber. And an empty line of text. So, let's get this money. Ooh, we got some flames on the walls. Hot damn. Hello there, you made it, for your, made it to your fifth gym battle. Only allowed to battle with the same amount of Pokemon as the leader. If you have more, you have to choose them before you can battle. Yep, I'm aware of how it works, man. Battling with an E... With four Pokemon, so you can choose only four of yours. Ooh, okay, so she's actually got four this time. Uh, we're used to only going with three, but interesting that we're going to see four this time, so that's cool. Anyway, let's head on in and see what kind of maze we're working with. More lava. This place is just lava the hell out. Okay, so we got these little levers here. Uh, we hit that, and it is going to make a rock appear right there. Can I just hop across this shit? Yep, we sure can. <laughs> we just hippity hop on across. Our fire will defeat you. Well, I sure hope not. I assume the gym leader maybe has around level 40. Uh, so this might be kind of scary. We'll see how it goes. Anyway, got a kidlet. Level 31. So kind of judging off of the little minion people. We're looking like we're in pretty good shape here. Acrobatics doesn't quite knock it out, but it misses a slam. Ha, you loser. That's why a slam sucks. Terrible accuracy. Not even a good move. But it's going to take, I mean, it's actually decent damage, but we do grow to level 38 there. We're probably just going to leave Dracula in front for a while. We got a cupboard here. Uh, we did actually catch one of these things last episode, which is pretty damn cool. And uh, I should probably use that thing eventually. He's a pretty badass looking dude. He probably evolves into a beast ass bear. Anyway, it's extinct. What? What are you talking about, lady? We're just going to hit this lever now and see. Okay, that just opens up that rock. Interesting. It has got to be. Way too damn hot in here. Imagine these working conditions. Sounds just awful. We got a karate guy. Hoya! 
Okay, I don't know what the hell you're doing in here, karate guy, but let's see what you got for me, buddy. Jackie just has one Pokemon, and it's a Grizzler. So that is the evolved form of the freaking Cubburn. And that's kind of empty. He's got, he's got a little headband. I love him. It's actually going to go down to an Acrobatics. So that shows that the thing is Fire-type. Um, I'm going to assume that the Gym Leader has the fully evolved form of that thing. And uh, that'll be kind of cool to see. Luckily, if it is Fighting-type, we'll be pretty good with with our buddy Drachibat here. So we're going to go ahead and click that there. Lever, bust out another boulder, and uh, let's keep on exploring. Hopefully there's a decent amount of other people to battle, because we'd like to get another level or two before. But we're looking pretty good. All right, we'll now hit this one. It's going to bring us to the psychic-looking lady. What's up? And then there's a hiker there, which I assume after the hiker, we're probably there. Okay, wait, no, that opened... Oh, man, they're making me backtrack and shit, man. What is this? Okay, we got to go back this way. And uh, now we can go like this, which brings us to a new area. Okay, cool. What's up, guy? My hot rocks will burn you out. You got some hot rocks, huh? Okay, well, rock type is not too good for us with Dracula in front. He's got a hot top. So it is only level 30, though. We could probably take this thing. But let's actually switch into happy. We're... A higher level with Dracula now, which is pretty good, but Happy's been a little bit neglected here. We've Oh my god, Lava Plume looks amazing in this game. And of course we get the burn. Damn you. Alright, uh, that actually hurt a little bit, but you should just go down to a Bubble Beam. Um, Bulldoze would actually be a good option too, but Bubble Beam does knock you right out. And uh, we have the EXP share on Happy. Might be a good idea to actually take that off, to be honest. We don't really need it for now. Or, not on Happy. Um... Freaking other dude. Okay, what was he about to send in? I did not see. It was probably another one of the same thing. Let's go into let's go into Marvin. I was paying attention to the freaking EXP chair, but it's just another hot top. We're good. Only level 30, so I do believe we're in pretty good shape for this gym. At least I think that, but I'll probably jinx it. But it's okay. Lightning Strike does knock you out. And another hot top. Coming at me with so many hot tops. Marvin might actually be pretty good for this gym too. He seemed pretty pretty neutral, unless they come at us with some ground type, fire type, I don't know. No, hot top. This guy's just got a shit ton of hot tops. Okay, um, we should probably just go ahead and use a burn heal. Or we actually just have a, let's use a heal pattern, why not? We'll use that on happy, and then we'll also just give you a nice little hyper potion. I should actually go back and buy some more of these. Now that I think about it, I think I meant to do that earlier, but... Okay, um, hold up. Is it Ghost that has the EXP share? Oh wait, he still has the Eevee Light. What, uh... I thought I put the EXP share on freaking Ghost, but I did not. Oh, it's Monsoon, of course, that's got it. Okay, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna just take that from you for now, because... You're not gonna be needing any experience for now. We'll probably just grind this thing up at some point later. Uh, let's actually just go ahead and give the EXP share back to Ghost. I was actually considering put an EXP share on Ghost last episode, but I remember I just left it on Monsoon. I will do some off-screen grinding for that thing probably eventually, but okay. Now let's actually just leave Happy in front. We do want to get you up to level 38, and now we can continue. Okay, so there's another level level, 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 level lever there. We're going to go ahead and hit that, and it looks like it's going to bring me up, but how the hell do I get to... Okay, yep. thought I was just going to go right here, but uh, we got to run our asses all the way this way. And what's happening? If you win, you can battle against Amber. Oh shit, so one more trainer before the gym leader is getting spicy. Lucy here just has a Grizzler. Um, this is not too good for Happy because of the fighting type, so you know what, I'm actually just gonna switch. Um, good to know this thing's typing before we before we just go for the gym leader. It does have Flamethrower, which does hurt, and of course we get another burn. What the hell is up with this, why? Too many burns. Okay, we're just going to acrobatics. Acrobatics is really good considering we don't have a hold item. We don't get the benefits of having the hold item, obviously, but it does just give us so much more power. And slash with a critical hit, which is what you're always freaking worried about when you see that. Doesn't quite knock us out, but I don't want to die here, so just in case this thing doesn't... If it has a freaking, like, priority move, that would be shitty. We're just going to full restore. Get Dracula nice and healthy here. Uh, looks like we're going to be close to level 39 before the gym. 
another flamethrower, and another burn. Ser I'm three for three on burns this episode. What the hell is going on here? I don't like this. Acrobatics should still do the job, and that there's a dead grizzler. I assume this thing evolves one more time. It, seems, it looks like it would, at least. And we do grow to level 39 there, so nice. What? All right. Um, wait, why the fuck did did Ghost just get? Did I put the Ghost EXP share on fucking Ghost? I meant to put the damn Evil Light. Jesus. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and uh, I, that was a complete derp on my end. We are gonna go ahead and give you not the EXP share, the Evil Light. They're both E's, and I am dumb. But we're good. Okay. So now let's hit this. I guess it's just going to bring us to the gym leader. Although, wait, there it looks like there's actually one more guy before the gym leader. What's happening here? Hold up. I thought that was the last lady. Hello, friend. Before you have the chance to battle Amber, I will be... Okay, well, that lady honey dicked me. She was like, if you beat me, you'll be able to battle Amber. But then, I guess maybe she was just saying that more in general rather than... I don't know. Okay, this you got a Blitzy. Um, is it is this thing really fire type? Why why is Blitzy on the volcano and shit? I don't understand. This thing looks like it'd be a freaking electric type. It's got to be an electric type. I'm sure we can take at least one attack from it. Let's go for an Aurora Beam. If this is super effective, it's flying type. We get a critical hit. Not very effective. Interesting. Okay, so it's just gonna hit us with a shockwave. Critical hit, of course. Why is there so many crits in this game? My god. Also, I should probably just be using Quick Attack over Aurora Beam. Um, I'm pretty sure they're about the same power after Stab anyway, but we just have a higher physical attack, so... Okay, like, next is another Blitzy. We are going to switch out. I guess that thing has to be... Um, it's gotta be a freaking Fire-type if you resist that ice, but... Interesting. So, Flame Burst is its strongest move. That's fine. All right, we'll just hit you with a side shock. How about that? Marvin has been a pretty good addition to the team. We like having Marvin around. All right. So we get a little bit more experience there. We get $1,000. And now we can hit this lever, which is going to allow us to take on Amber. Although we are going to go buy some Hyper Potions first and also get one last heal. Because you never know. We might end up using a shit ton of Hypers. Um... This could be scary. I hope that I really hope I'm ready for this. Every time I battle a new gym leader, it's like you never you never know what the hell is gonna happen. But I think we're I think we're ready. We'll probably lead off with happy, just in hopes that it's not a, a blitzy thingy, fire electric type, I assume. But uh, get a nice little heal, and then we'll head up to that there Mart. Take my Pokemon, damn it! All right, thank you. Okay, so I haven't bought I haven't bought any items in quite some time, but we're gonna grab ourselves some of these hyper bad boys. We have nearly a hundred thousand, so we're looking pretty good. Let's just get like ten of these things, and then I guess I should probably I need to stock up on Ultra Balls too. I only have ten in the bag, so we'll get like fifteen more of these, just so that I don't have to worry about getting those things later. And then uh, might as well just grab some supers too, just in case. Always good to have a couple super potions hanging around in the old bag. $69,000, but we just ruined that, but that's fine. All right. Let's go kick ourselves some fire gym leader ass. Shall we? At least we hope. Please, no deaths. <laughs> the team is in a pretty good spot now. We just don't need any deaths. Although, I, I did mention how I was going to lead off with Happy, but it doesn't matter who is in front because we actually just get to choose our... Choose our setup, so we run this way, and we are here. What is up? So here we have Amber. Uh, we are looking good. I guess we're probably going to go Marvin, Happy, and Dracula. Also, should probably stick an item on you. Matter of fact, Marvin, you don't have anything. What do we have for you? Uh, we do have the cell battery, which increases the damage of... I don't know, so no, cell battery, if we get hit with an electric move, attack will raise. But I thought we had a, an item as well for that. We do have the Razor Claw. Uh, we could get some boosted crit chances, but yeah, I think we just might have to go Razor Claw. Yep, you know what? Let's give you a Razor Claw, buddy. You seem like the type of guy that can take advantage of that. There we go. All right, so we actually, ooh, well, we get to bring four. 
Um, and that's kind of interesting because I don't know who the fourth is going to be. We're obviously going to bring Happy Dracula and Marvin. But then other than that, Monsoon's not good enough to battle. Ghost is frail as shit. That thing's probably going to die. I think we'll just probably go with Charlotte. Uh, but if shit gets crazy, we might have to sack off Charlotte. Anyway, let's do it. What's happening, lady? Oh, hello, Hayden. Thank you for all you did at Mount High Point. I don't know who they are or what they want, but I'm sure it's not good. Anyway, our battle, as you know, I'm Amber. Uh, the gym leader of High Point Gym. I use Fire-type Pokemon, so I hope you're ready for this. Come on, show me your skills. So yeah, we did battle alongside her last episode, but now we get to take her on ourselves. So let's lead off with Happy, and then we'll go Dracula, and then Marvin, and Charlotte. Pretty solid squad there. Let's get it. Ooh, look at them flames. Yo, she hot. Literally. <laughs> Alright, so first gym leader that has four Pokemon, I believe. She leads off with a hot top. And uh, that's perfect. So we got Happy in front. Come out sparkling. And only level 33. So we are in a pretty good spot here. I should have just gone for Bulldoze. I don't think it really matters. As Bubble Beam just knocks you out. So, alright. That's our first... First Pokemon down, three to go. Next is a Blitzaglow. All right, that is for sure the evolved form of that freaking electric fire boy. And we have to go into Marvin. Marvin's really our only option here. Uh, other than that, we don't have much for these. So let's hope that we can take it. Oh, shit, he orange now. So it does have Flame Burst. Flame Burst as its highest damage move. Um, let's just go for a Psy Shock. We are faster, which is nice. And almost knock it out in one hit. Goes for a flame burst. But uh, critical hit. Why is the crit ratio in this game so damn high? Uh, she is going to bust out a super potion here. Of freaking course she is. But uh, you ain't got no hypers. Or full restores. So that's actually going to knock it out. So Blitzaglow goes down. And Marvin does grow to level 39. Looking good. Next is a Billaze. No idea what the hell a Billaze is. Um... I think it's probably best. Let's just, let's go into Dracula. Everybody's getting some love. Um, so let's see. Is this the bear thing? No, that is a fucking. What the hell? Okay. Um, interesting little goat you got here. Um, probably should have gone into Happy to be honest. But let's just hit this thing with an acrobatics. I don't think it's gonna have anything that can hit us and kill us in one hit. Uh, we are level 39 against the 34. We're pro we're pretty good here. Show off some acrobatics, which does freaking nothing. My god, okay. Now it's going to flame wheel us, but that doesn't do anything either. And let's actually just go for some crunches now, because we will get some health back from... Okay, that did actually... That did more. Bloodthirst is going to help us out there. And body slam, huh? Alright, another critical hit. And the paralyze. Really, bro? Really? Okay, well, we can take one more attack. Let's try to go for another cr crunch here, or should I... You know what, actually? False alarm, we're just going to full restore. Because we want to end this matchup with us being in the best position we can. So we'll full restore here. See what this thing wants to do. It's just going to go for another flame charge. Potential speed boost. Yep, there's the speed boost. That's fine though. Doesn't do much. Now we can just finish you off with a crunch. And why was crunch doing more to this thing? I'm... Oh, it's because I have the lucky egg on it. Damn it, I was using the... <laughs> I have just been blowing it on my items today. Yeah, it's for sure because I have the lucky egg on um, I forgot that I had that when I was grinding it, and that is quite unfortunate. But you know, whatever. We're still gonna be, we're still gonna be good here. I don't think we need. I mean, fuck, man. The last Pokemon's actually probably gonna be the Fighting type that we need the fly, the flying move for. It's okay. It's okay. How did I forget that we had a Lucky Egg on there? I really should have checked that before. That's gonna go for a Workup, which doesn't really matter. Gonna root, uh, boost out their attack, and one more Crunch is gonna take care of it, and we actually do end up the matchup. With full health, we're looking good here. Get a bunch of experience. And a Magrizzly. So, yep, it is definitely the fully evolved form of the Cubburn. And, uh, we could actually just go into... Marvin actually would be a good option here. Considering I'm a dumbass and left my Lucky Egg on, let's just go ahead and go into Marvin. And, uh, we're gonna need to heal first. But we'll at least be able to scout out and see what this thing wants to go for. So, I assume it's just a fire fighting type. Holy shit, okay. It's got Solar Claw. That is a interesting sounding move. So, it's only level 36. And uh, we're pretty good here. Okay, let's just go for... Let's go for a Hyper Potion on you, buddy. Get you back to full, see what this thing wants to go for. And a Psy Shock should hurt this thing pretty good. It's actually just going to Slash. I hate seeing Slash. Okay. Uh, we can take it. We're good. 
We're just going to go for a side shock here. We are faster. Let's just get a crit and knock it out. How about that? Nope. Okay, not quite. And it's going to go for another slash. No crit, please. Oh, my Jesus. It did critical hit, but we live it with 22. Good to know that we're able to live a crit. And we do have to um, go for another hyper here. We're just going to get you back to full. And it looks like we are going to end up, end up on top on this one. So I'm glad that... I did that grinding session a couple episodes ago because it really kind of saved our lives. So we are going to be faster. A Psy Shock is going to be able to knock it out. And that was pretty bad. I'm definitely dumb for leaving that Lucky Egg on there. But, you know, shit happens. You blew out my fire. I sure did. I'll blow your fire any day, lady. Congratulations on your victory. You have won the Blast Badge. So we got ourselves the Blast Badge, huh? Well, that looks pretty damn cool. So uh, we're really filling out the old... The old badge uh, case, huh? Also, you can have this for winning. And we get TM-106 for Solar Claw. Solar Claw. This move takes two turns. The user draws sunlight into its claw and then releases it at the opponent. So it's like Solar Beam. Good luck on your journey, Hayden. I hope we meet again. Well, cool. So we didn't lose anybody. And uh, we definitely call that a win. So definitely a little sloppy. A little bit sloppy, I'll admit. Messing up my items. Putting the fucking EXP share back on... <laughs> back on ghost and then leaving the lucky egg but we're good so we are essentially done with high point city although uh oh something's happening please don't battle me sir watch out you watch out buddy oh it's you hayden you won the blast badge sure did that's awesome i'm just about to battle amber now i hope i win i would battle you but i want to save my energy for the gym battle you see thank god thank god oh shit what's going on here now shit about to erupt bro boy Hayden, before you go, I want to ask you a favor. You see, after our battle, I had a thought. Uh, these people know that I have the core stone, and they will come back for it. I know this, so I want to ask you this. It's dangerous, but will you take the core stone with you on your journey? I know that you'll keep it safe. She trusts me with core stone. What people? What's a core stone? Man, Rodney, you've really been missing out. Who are you? Oh, Rodney? Sorry, but I can't let anyone else know that Hayden has the core stone, so please keep it a secret. I have no idea what this is about, so okay. Thank you. So please, Hayden, take the core stone and keep it safe. So we got ourselves, I feel like that's probably not a good idea to be holding on to that. We're going to get into some freaking trouble, but that's fine. I know that it'll be safe with you. So Rodney, would you like, you would like to battle? She's going to need to run to the Poké Center real quick because she just caught that work. But all right. So cool. Looks like we are pretty much done with the city. We kind of came, climbed a volcano, had a, had a great time, and we just defeated the gym leader. So we are looking nice. We are going to heal up here. And now it's actually going to be a good time to... I uh, kind of grind up the rest of the team members that um, have gotten a little bit neglected lately. So we can actually just put the EXP share back on Monsoon. Um, probably should have just left it on this thing, but I just wanted to make sure we got all the experience possible. So there you go. You can have that. And uh, let's go ahead and put Charlotte in front for now. Ghost is probably still going to need some work until we can freaking use that thing. We're kind of close to evolving. I'm pretty sure it evolves at level 44. But... Uh, yeah, so, all right, let's go ahead and take, take a look at the old Poke gear here. See uh, what we're looking like on the map. So, high point, and then we need to go back to docking port since... Oh, no, we need to do... What we do need to do, which I totally forgot about, was we need to get the keys from... Which... Where the hell... Which which house is it that uh, we're supposed to get those from? Because our main mission in coming here was we were supposed to get um, the keys for the boat or whatever. I don't remember what the hell house it was though. Why you gotta hide? Why you gotta hide it from me? What the hell even is this anyway? Oh, it's the. We can actually use this now. Um, that's cool. So we can actually grab the keys, and then now we can use the little, the little zip line ass thingy. Hello. Jewel mine. Okay, yeah, you're you're not the guy, not the guy I was looking for, sir. I know it's just a girl that has the keys. Where the hell did that house go? I thought it was right next to the Poke Center. But it looks like I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Uh, is it you? Nope, it's not. Mysterious volcano. Didn't see any legendary Pokemon, unfortunately. But hopefully soon. Where the fuck is the house that the person gives me the keys? I am confusion. There's really nowhere else to wait. No, wait, wait. Is it this house? Probably gonna be the last house I go into. No, it's not. Famous move tutor. Okay, yes. Yeah, so we still don't have any damn red shards for you. No, no. Why can't I remember? It's been a couple days since I last bulk recorded, which is why 
When you guys watch these things, it seems like it's happening all like at once, but I definitely go like a week without, yeah, it's, it's, it's a struggle, okay? I never know where the fuck I'm going. We have these houses up here. Okay, it's probably the one to the left. No, it's you. It's you. Who are you? Oh, Daddy asked you to get his boat keys. He always forgets them. Please take them to him when you can. And we got ourselves the boat keys. So freaking finally just had to, you know, re-explore the city, but we got it. And now we can head back to the docking port. And then from there, I assume we're going to be able to take a nice little boat ride. And that should be fun. So let's actually... Let's use this here so we don't have to run our asses all the way back through that shitty route. And this is going to... Wait, do we, do we already go? Yeah, we're back in docking ports. That was just a nice little teleport we had going there. And uh, alrighty then. So we're just going to head all the way back up this way to the boats. Here we are. Who am I supposed to... You got the keys. Thanks. Now, as I promised, I can take you to Route 9, which leads you to Waytide City. Should I take you to Route 9? You sure should, buddy. Okay, let's go ahead and go to Route 9, where we can catch a new wild Pokemon. We're headed to a new city. And it's a whole new day. Here we are. If you want to go back to Docking Port, just tell me. I will take you there. Cool. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are at a whole new route. It's looking pretty damn tropical and pretty awesome. So, we're going to check this out next time. Sandcastle Coast. Should be a swell time. What do you think, Charlotte? What do you got for me? It's a pearl. Nice. All right, we always take them pearls. So, all right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button on the video if you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out.